This is a quick overview of how to bring linked objects from Excel to PowerPoint. A linked object allows you to bring a object from one page to the other and create a synchronization among those objects, even if the program is closed. As such, we have object of height over here. We have set to 20. We set our constant of gravity to negative 9.8. If you times those two together, you will get negative 196. If we were to change one, all we have to do is click on the object. It'll take us directly to the object in the Excel document. You can change this without even having to click on it. So if let's pick 100, press enter, you'll notice that it changes the value here. It also changes the other objects that are linked together, such as the 980 down here and our object down here. You can change the constant in here to 10 and it will automatically make the changes across. Sometimes changes may not occur and you may need to right click and update the link. To bring the object over, we can simply Let's go and delete these. You can simply copy, then go to Home on your PowerPoint, Paste, Paste Special, and Paste Link. From here, click OK, and your object is transferred over. We'll do it one more time with the gravity. Copy, paste, special, from the home tab, paste link, and OK. To check to see if you have linked correctly, once you're done, simply double click on the object and it'll highlight the area that you're in. You can move more than one object at a time by selecting whatever the section is you want to copy. Right click copy or control V, home, paste special, paste link, OK, drag and drop. If the object is closed, and you click to open, it will directly open it immediately. Also, if you were to close the PowerPoint and make changes to 10 instead of negative. Save, and we were to close that. You can now bring back up your PowerPoint and it will ask you to update the links. And therefore our gravity has changed to a positive.